Welcome to the Terror Dome in New Orleans, Louisiana, where it is never safe to go out in public on Fat Tuesday. Why is that, Grim? Uh, that's because Tuesday's when they have to lure the zombies back into the stadium, so they let a few fat people out to lead them back inside. You know, a little bait. And this is going to be a bloody game. The teams are loading their weapons and sharpening their spikes. The Philadelphia Eagles go up against the New Orleans Zombies. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> If the sound of a torn Achilles followed by laughter and taunting brings a smile to your face, you are tuned to the right place. Hi everyone, Grim Blitzrow and the MFL crew is coming to you live on game day. Bricks, any uh, thoughts on today's game? Um, I thought I had one, but uh, I think I might have forgotten it. Oh, I remember. Uh, I forgot who's playing today. Careful what you ask for, Grim. And it's first and ten. It's about a three-yard pickup. Second down and seven. He hit that line the way a Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. And it's first and ten. Four yards on that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. The quarterback had no time to throw, and the defense gets a big sack. <laughs> And that'll bring him third down and seven. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. He took a beast boost injection. Now watch him stomp all over his opponents. I want to take a beast boost injection too. Yeah, now that has weird side effects, Bricks. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. When defensive players go berserk, they've been known to rip the heads off of Boom, and he's dead! Oh, bingo! Bingo, bingo! I got bingo, Grim! Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day, because he's the one who just got wiped out. And it's first and ten. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. A mix 
rates of tiger blood, shark blood, and internet comments, Roid Rage brings out the worst in anyone. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! <laughs> well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Point. And a well-placed cleat. Second and three. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. play that was bricks kind of like your aunt bertha this guy has some big balls what a hit yeah she does have a big pair grim you're right and the defense gets the quarterback for a sack Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. One, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. First and four. Hot, hot one, hot two. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. The kick is good. Uh, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. First and ten. The teams are all tied up at the end of quarter one. We'll be right back. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all... Since when is that a penalty? Well, since now, I guess, Grim. Yeah. 
Second down in a mile. And they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. He picks up five on that play. Third down and the QB is saying his prayers. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Second down and more than the QB would like. Hot one, hot two, hot. for a first down. And it's first and ten. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Third down and three. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It's good. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. Oh, nice hit! First and ten. Hot, hot one. Hey. And the defense calls the thunderclap dirty trick. Man, that's got to hurt. Then I'll make the hair on your corpse stand straight up. Second down and five. Hot, hot one. Hey. Defense holds that pass play to only two yards. Third down and three. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. First and ten. Wow! The quarterback just threw a sonic blast to his receiver. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! Yeah, big deal. Missed a meat for Bray Tram and the ball didn't fall down.
And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Red ball just sliced through the defense like butter. I wish defenses were made out of butter. A lot of guys talk about stepping up their game, Bricks. He just stepped up and blew up. <laughs> He's got a lot of guts, doesn't he? And you can see the grounds crew cleaning him up now. Hot potato gets him every time. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. Nice pickup for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. Hot. Hot. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. First and eight to go. And they just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback can be hurting, or dead, or worse. Second down and nine. Running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. Quarterback passes for a touchdown. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good! And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. First and ten. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga, after. and they take their first time out. Uh, how predictable! Surprise us next time. Call the timeout during halftime. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. Throw, good catch, but not quite good enough at nine yards. And then the quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the clock. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Brits' ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit six. I called for the first down. And it's first. The quarterback just used his final timeout. Let's see what they come up with on the next play. 
Most kickers should be able to make this one. But will this kicker make it? Find out next time on NFL Game Day. The uh, NFL is... He's got the distance, and the kick is good! The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! It's a close battle as the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsatan Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. It's anyone's game as the third quarter begins. Both teams have taken their performance-enhancing drugs, and everyone is ready to rock and roll. The teams line up for the second half kickoff. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Second down and long. A second there. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he put all of his foot into that one. They just let that one drop and play it safe, and the defense says, we'll take it. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. Second down and a lot. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. Third down, and the punter is warming up. And the ball razors through the defense, cutting a defender in half. He could go all the way. He's at the 40. He's at the 30. He's at the 20. The 10.
They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Man, what a hit that was! And it's first and ten. way to keep the chains moving that was beautiful and it's first and ten he caught it and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone except maybe self-doubt but he seems to have worked through it I like this, they're going for two. The QB threads the needle for two points. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. He refuses to go down. And it's first and ten. loves punishing the defenders. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So is that cheerleader. Second down and ten. four more downs to punish the defense and you better believe they will and it's first and ten defense holds him to a four yard pickup there second down and six The 
teams have kept each other at bay for now. But there's still plenty of time to bribe refs and kill the other team's star players, so it's anyone's game, really, Bricks. Second down and six. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. And that'll bring up third and one. And that's how you shock the monkey. Thunderclap. Oh, with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. Kaboom! And the quarterback unleashes a sonic button. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. up nine yards on that catch and that'll bring up second and one and they brought him to a dead stop literally <laughs> oh man the offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster when a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. And it's first and ten. A pickup of about three on that play. Second down and seven. First down! I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Oh, this berserk dirty trick ain't fair to the QB. <laughs> Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. Second and three. Oh, great throw! Great catch! And that puts six points on the board! The defense can do anything to stop a throw that good, Ben! You mean aside from bribing the ref, killing the quarterback, or actually playing some D? They're going for two points. Run it in for two points. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed, it was a chip wearing a wig. <laughs> and it's first and ten.
third down and never going to happen. Roid Rage, how do you like your brains? Scrambled or fried? One Roid Rage breakfast special coming up. He scores! He earned those points on the heels of an epic run. Nah, don't call things epic, Grim. Kids aren't going to think you're cool no matter what you do. Junior, I don't want kids to think I'm cool. <laughs> Now there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. It's good. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And it's first and ten. And he just used his beast boost dirty trick, and there's no way to stop him. Unless, of course, you kill him. Wow, look at that freak go! He's unstoppable! Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? We're at the two-minute mark in the second half. And it's first and ten. A brutal hit. Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. And it's first and ten. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Hey, man, nobody can touch me with eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, pal? Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. And he gets into the end zone for the conversion. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know what? I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> the home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. And the defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only thing the QB can do now is run for his life. Or die. <laughs> and he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. Time. Like a jack in a box, Bricks. You never know when one of those hot potatoes is gonna blow. You just crap your pants, Junior. They stop the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Ah, uh, that's okay, Grim. They can have nine. That's uh that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do.
Second down. The quarterback burns his last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. He dropped it, you putts. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. <laughs> and they fool the defense with a run play and pick up the first down. Oh, this game is so exciting, I think I just peed my pants. No, it was the other one. Uh-oh. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Second down and ten. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You got to keep your eye on the ball. The New Orleans Zombies had their guts and ate them too and went at home. That was one hell of a slugfest. That was worth the price of admission, right, guys? I paid for admission. I expect girls dancing on a pole or something. Girls, what the hell about a lap dance? You don't even have a lap, you little freakazoid. Follow me. Let's see what the MVP has to say about today's outcome. Yeah, man, I was keeping on, you know, now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SM thank our viewing audience and the Newton Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.